it is Monday, Mailbox Monday. That was so lame. I don't know what that was. I need a song for this, I think, because I always get so excited that I want to sing, but I sound really lame. So, <laughs> hello, beauty babes. Welcome back to my channel. I am Maria, aka Agape Love Girl. Thank you so much for stopping by today. I have quite a bit of things that I got. So as usual, I want to cut to the chase and like get right into it because I'm so excited about all the things that I got in the mail this week. Like I just, oh, I'm so excited. So let's go ahead and get right into it. This first item I got, I'm super excited about because this is the Dior Skin Nude Skin Glowing Makeup. It is foundation and I have never, I'm trying to think, aside from I guess my Lorac um, powder foundation stuff, but it's not like a foundation foundation. I mean, anyways, I've never really had a very expensive high-end foundation, so I'm super, super excited about this. I'm actually wearing it on my face today. Does my face look flawless or what? No, just kidding. I don't know. Um, <laughs> such a dork. I did receive this for free to review from We Make Beauty. We Make Beauty is an online um, site for um, high-end uh, cosmetics ranging from skincare, nails, hair, beauty products. Um, they sell at discount prices. So um, I do have a code for you and I believe that that code is Agape Love Designs 2015 and I will go ahead and insert it right here for you guys um, and I'll also link it down below in the description box for your convenience. That code gets you 15% off and it's good for the entire year. So if you want to check out their site and, and get cosmetics at a discounted price plus an extra discount then definitely check them out but like I said I did receive this um, to review and so I will have a review coming up of this product and it is so beautiful um, I've actually never had any Dior products at all and so anyways this is what it looks like I got the shade 30 um, <laughs> this has SPF 15 in it and it sounds really amazing. Um, I really like it so far. I've used it only twice. So once before and then today. Um, but anyways, I will have a review on this and more information on the site as well coming up in a blog post and probably um, a video as well. So stay tuned to that. All right, I have this little box here which is a mix of a bunch of different things that I got recently. Um, this first thing is something that I purchased myself. This is um, the Model Co. Nude Illusion Lip Liner. I ha still have um, quite a bit of my original one of these left, but I, I am kind of dwindling down and I have been using it a, a lot more lately and I was kind of worried about running out of this product and I really didn't want to. Um, I originally received my Model Co. Lip Liner in, I believe, a Beauty Box 5 subscription box and I liked it a lot, but... <laughs> I liked it a lot but didn't really use it very much at first and then since I've started really getting to wear a lot more lipstick lately and trying to make an effort to wear more of it lately because I do have so much, um, I've been using this as my lip liner and it's absolutely amazing. It's perfect. It truly is like a nude lip liner and it's just become my absolute favorite. So anyways, I wanted to go on the site and purchase it but they are completely out of stock so I resorted to searching Amazon and eBay and found someone selling a brand new one on eBay and so um, I think I actually did get it at a discounted price too because this retails for $20 which seems like insane for a lip liner but it really is amazing it has a built-in sharpener and I just really really love it and so um, it was probably also good that I got it from eBay also because this site is in like where is this site? Australia. So shipping would have been crazy. Um, <laughs> so anyways, I did purchase that on eBay and I'm so glad to have it back up. Um, the next couple of things are something I also did purchase myself because they were having a sale for iMats, like an iMat sale while they were at iMats. And um, let me just put that up there real quick. Okay, so I mentioned Second Love Cosmetics, I believe, in my last Mailbox Monday video. Um, I did receive um, a few of their items uh, to review for them, and I'll just tell you right now, I didn't go in with the blog review because I didn't end up liking the products, um, some of the products 
that much. So, um... Not that I want to, like, lie or keep anything from you guys. It's just, like, I'd rather put up things that I really, really love. And so I was just selective about what I posted about. And so I only posted about the lip products because those are, those are the items that I really, really liked from it. I did get, like, a color correcting cream and then a concealer and then a glitter palette that was, like, um, a sticky glitter palette. And those really just did not work for me. I found them to be really sheer and kind of oily. And the glitter palette was just really hard to work with. And I tried several different ways. And so my opinions is that um, I would kind of steer clear from those. Um, the quality, I don't know, I just, I, I hate saying mean things. But for me, they just didn't really work very well. I did not like them. Um, but the lip products, I loved so and not and not only that the packaging of second love cosmetics is just so cute so gorgeous and it's just so spot on and i am a sucker for packaging so i did see they were having a sale and so then i went in and bought a few more of their lip products because i really did like their lip products that much and if you follow me on instagram you know that i've been <laughs> posting a lot of like makeup and beauty photos because I've been getting into doing a little bit more of kind of like a photography um, of my beauty products and stuff like that so I've ha been having a lot of fun um, taking photos of products and so these are items that I just think are so 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 cute and you can check out my Instagram um, to see up close photos of these so I won't like zoom in and show you guys that but if so if you want to see them you could definitely check out my Instagram but this is their um, heart-shaped lipstick so it comes in this adorable packaging that has hearts all over it this is in the shade 11 affection and what it is is a lips tint and um like i said you'll have to go to my instagram page but this is a heart shaped and it's got the lip color in the middle and then a glittery lip balm on the outside and i haven't used it yet but i'm going to um i just took pictures of them yesterday and so i haven't actually tried them yet because i almost don't want to ruin them and then I got another one of that same kind of lipstick, and this one is in the shade 02 Cupid, and it's just a pink shade. And so I only got two of those ones because I wasn't sure about how I felt about them, but I just really like the packaging. And it's almost Valentine's Day, so it kind of was just like, I have to have those. Okay. And then the next things I got were their Luxie Lace Lipsticks. And this is one actually that I received from them for free um, that I mentioned in my last Mailbox Monday. And this was the shade um, three, number three, Precious. And this is a pink shade. I have pictures of this um, up on my Instagram. It is a really gorgeous color and it's just a really great quality. And, and like I said, the packaging is just adorable. It's really unique. It's a square packaging kind of and it's... um clear and then the actual lipstick tube itself has this lace print on it that's just so cute i love it i love it so then i ordered three more of those because i really really like those i ordered this one is number eight lavish and it's kind of like a perfect rose shade and i will have photos of this on my instagram account as well and swatches and stuff like that coming up i haven't done the lip swatches yet um but i will then i have number seven fame and this is more of a darker pink that kind of leans towards a purpley tone. Or, um, yeah, I don't know. I'd have to swatch it to see. I haven't swatched it yet, like I said. But it looks a little bit more like a fuchsia purpley toned pink. And then the last lipstick I got is number five, Sassy. And this is a, this is the color that I saw a swatch of it on their Instagram account and was like, I must have that one. Because I don't know why I absolutely love corally pink lipsticks and so like I said this is a corally pink shade it is just so beautiful and I really cannot wait to wear them swatch them and I will have photos of those probably going up exclusively on my Instagram account I have been posting a lot of photos that are just exclusive to my Instagram account just to keep you guys um you know entertained and not seeming like it's the same thing on every single one of my social media sites so something new um, on each site that you follow of mine All right and the other thing I got was um, some nail polishes so these polishes are from play love laugh and they're really adorable and what I did receive these um, to review I thought these would be really great because these are um, natural they're made with like fruit and vegetable base um, they're natural so that I think this is leaning more towards like for your children and if you don't want to use anything with like, a bunch of chemicals it has a really crazy smell um, and I believe also these are polishes that easily peel off so you also don't need chemicals to remove them 
and I just thought it would be really fun to do a review on these and most of you guys know that my daughter absolutely loves nail polish and she has her own nail polish Instagram page and so I thought it'd be really fun because we've been doing a lot of mother-daughter manis together and so I thought it'd be fun to review these and I got the shade oh they're not written on here I don't think oh no they are sweet purple and this is kind of like a pearly pearlized looking purple and then this one is purple fairy twinkle and this is a um glitter so it's they're really really cute and i will have more photos to share with you guys in my review and i'm pretty sure i will also be posting pictures on my instagram page as well so that's something to look forward to if you are someone who likes nail polishes and likes all natural things or has a young daughter who you want to use something natural on Okay, so this next thing I have to tell you about, I am so excited about. I purchased this myself. I didn't receive this review, but I had seen on someone's Instagram page, I want to say my newest beauty addiction or my newest addiction. I can't remember. I'll have to link her below. But anyways, she had posted a picture of how she cleans her brushes and the tools she used, and I had everything that she had except for this kind of item and I asked her where she got it and so I went and looked it up and it was just a little bit out of my price range so what I did is go ahead and search around for similar products and I happened to find this on eBay I believe and um, I will post a link in the description box below for your convenience if you want to check it out because anyways so this is just an adorable um, stand for holding your brushes when you're cleaning them it says come apart so I was able to quickly put it together and you could also put it away when it's not in use but it's actually pretty cute because it has the little hearts on it and I'm a sucker for anything with hearts. It's got these little plastic inserts right here where you could kind of stick your brushes in there so once you're done cleaning them to let them dry so rather than having them dry like on a flat surface or trying to hang them up all crazy you can stick them in here and hang them to dry which I think is so neat. Let me grab a brush to show you. So here's a brush, and you would just, once you're done cleaning it, stick it on there and stick it on here. And it does, this one that I got um, has bigger size holes and then also smaller ones, as you can see, so you can fit in a variety of different brush sizes when you're washing them. And then as well, um, they did have a black one uh, and then a black and white one, and each one... Um, had different size holes in it, I believe, but I just wanted to get this one that had the variety of different sizes. Anyways, and so I'm really excited about that because washing brushes can be such a chore and I like anything that's gonna make it a little bit easier. This next item I got, or this next package I got was actually a thank you from Lean of Trace Skinner X. And we did a giveaway recently together and so she just wanted to send me a thank you package and I'm so thankful. So I thought it was so sweet that she wanted to send me this thank you. And so what she sent me was this little trial size of the purifying cleanser, which most of you guys know even the trial sizes last forever um, for quite a long time. And so I really am appreciative of that. So I have this kind of backup once mine um, runs out. And then she also sent me the night repair moisture which I actually did not have that anymore when I made my second purchase I didn't purchase this I really wanted to but I was trying to be frugal and so she sent me the trial size of the night repair moisture cream and I love this stuff it's absolutely amazing so thank you so much lean most of you guys know that I have switched back to using uh, Trace Skinner X as my main skincare system it just really works and it you know, I love it for my skin, so I'm just super thankful to be on it again and that she sent me these little goodies as a thank you. So thank you so much, Lean. The next items I have are kind of like an exciting sneak peek to something that's coming soon to Lux Pineapple. Um, I can't tell you more about the brand or anything like that except for this. Um, these will be available soon on the Lux Pineapple site and I got to have them first. These are lip glosses and this red one, I don't think they have names or anything yet. Um, they are that new but I got them to try and I will have photos and swatches and stuff like that up soon to share with you guys. Um, I did wear this red one the other day and oh my gosh it is so opaque like in an instant it's opaque and it's long lasting it's not kiss proof or smudge proof or anything but it's very 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 long lasting and opaque it does have this um 
brush tip so it's a brush tip applicator and so I got a red one and then also a sheer um, shimmery pink one they also have another slightly uh, more probably I think opaque than this one lighter pink and then a nude color um, but those will be coming soon to the Luxe Pineapple site and that is all I'm allowed to say to you guys right now but I absolutely love them and stay tuned for lip swatches and all that coming soon this next item is something that I also did receive as well to review and I was really really intrigued by this item because well let's face it mama likes to eat okay so um most of you guys know that I've been on a weight loss journey for the past three years now it has been three years can you believe that um and my biggest downfall and struggle really has been food and eating and overeating. I really love to eat. I really love food. And a lot of the times I find myself wanting to eat and I'm not even hungry. I'll just have this craving to eat food um, and just have the urge to stuff my face. So um, I applied for a promotion to review these suppress mints and I pre-review review here for you. I um, did use these uh, the other day and I felt like it really did help me suppress the cravings to and, and urge to eat so so far I'm liking them but what it is is like these little mints that you kind of keep in your mouth and they slowly dissolve over the period of about three hours and help suppress your appetite so you don't have the urge to keep eating and eating especially when you're really not hungry um, and then uh, it does come with these um, it did come with these little travel containers so you could put a couple pills or mints in here and then take it and stick it in your purse or your pocket and take it with you to go when you're out um i don't know about you guys but i know that when i'm out with friends and my sisters and we're just shopping um even if i'm not hungry even if we just eat in lunch there's just something about being out and about and hanging out with friends that makes me want to be like hey let's stop here and like eat snacks or let's stuff our faces and you know so <laughs> I was really kind of excited to try these out and see if they worked and anything to help me kind of um, behave when it comes to food is, you know, something that intrigues me. So I will be doing a review on those um, on the blog. All right, and I have a couple more items to share with you and I'm saving the best for last so I'm so excited. All right, this next package is one that I received from bornprettystore.com. I have worked with them before in the past to do reviews and stuff like that. And so they reached out to me again to see if I'd like to do um, a few more reviews for them. And so, of course, I said yes. Um, they offer very, very, very affordable um, items. And so I got to pick a few things to try out. And the first thing I got was a nail stamper kit. And you guys probably won't be able to see this. Um, there's this little blue film over. I'd have to take it off. But um, the main image in this is a Marilyn Monroe stamp. And I was like, yes, must have a Marilyn Monroe nail stamp. And um, get a cute nail stamp design to put on my fingers. So I'm really, really excited about that. And then I also picked a few um, of their lashes. Now these ones are really cute. They're kind of like studded with um, some rhinestones at the tip. And I just thought that might be fun for a really dramatic, fun look. And then these are lashes that are colored. They're black with also um, some purple hairs in it. And I thought, again, that would be really fun for some dramatic looks. Do you know me and my colors? <laughs> And then also I picked up these, um, which are like seriously all the rage right now and um, really probably doesn't require a review, but these are like the um, metallic uh, temporary tattoos, you know, and I just thought they were so cute and so fun. I've been seeing them everywhere and kind of just really been wanting to try them myself. So I did grab these things. And I will have, um, I will go ahead and just link all these items in the description box below for your convenience. So if you are interested in them, you will have a direct link right to them if you want. Alright, so the very last thing I got, and I have these all in a baggie, um, this was a special package to me from My Beauty Addiction. You may or may not know that they recently launched their new press shadows, their Silk Effects shadows. Normally they only carried um, loose pigments shadows and um, so now they started carrying press shadows and so I was sent 10 of them before they launched to, you know, 
play around with and I have already a blog post um, with photo swatches but I'm also going to be doing a video and showing live video swatches because I know sometimes people like to see that in comparison to photos and I know sometimes photos don't necessarily always show true to color and so I think it would be great to show um, to do a video so you guys can actually see live swatches as well but I will also link um, the blog post with the photo swatches for you if you're curious to check them out but let me just tell you right now these are amazing I will just show you really quick because like I said I will have a video going up on them very soon but this is what they look like they come packaged like this and look like this and they are super creamy buttery um pigmented like a dream like you barely have to put your finger in there and there's that and I'll just do this swatch from afar here like oh my god look at that are you kidding me these seriously are a must-have I think in my opinion um, for those of you who um, don't necessarily like loose pigments but maybe want something pressed and then the quality of my beauty addiction obviously is top-notch amazing you know they've been my favorite for a long time and I'm not just saying that because I am now their social media manager I've always loved my beauty addiction or MBA cosmetics as they are now going by um, but yeah I will be doing a video showing you all the colors I got I did get 10 and I plan to get a few more um, it's just so exciting. But anyways, look forward to that video review of the swatches and then also check out the blog post for the photo swatches and let me know because I will be doing a look and showing you guys how these wear and how they apply and all that stuff on the eyes actually. Um, so let me know which shadow you would like to see me really focus on because I want to post something that you guys want to see. And then in addition to that, I also got four of their new glitters that are not even released yet. They don't even have names yet, but I got them early to kind of play around with and also photograph. And I will be posting photos on um, my Instagram account and then probably my blog soon, if not already. They are holographic glitters and they, oh my gosh, let me just tell you, they are stunning. I already took some photos of these and they are gorgeous. You guys are going to love them. And so that is just a little sneak peek of what is to come. Also, just so you guys know, because this is so exciting that there is so many new products, I do have a discount code for you guys now that is available as long as you need it. There is no um, expiration date on this code. So if you would like to purchase some of these new products or just anything from My Beauty Addiction, um, then you can use the code AgapeLove15 and that will get you 15% off your complete order and you could use that as many times as you want and as long as you want. Anyways, that is all and I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this was super long but I was just really over the top excited about all these items and just excited to share them with you. And until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye. So you could put a couple peels, peels. <laughs> um, I wanna. I'm just super. <laughs> la 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 la. And then it has these little um, plastic things. I feel like I don't know what I'm talking about. I am Maria. This next one. <laughs> Can I open this? Oh my god. Open. <laughs> um, I still, I have, and this just comes on here. Uh, super easy, right? No, <laughs> or something, or Austria, or, no, where is it? It's in another country. So re um, or has a young child, a lot, <laughs>